Hey everybody, Justin here for another exciting episode of Marvel Legendary. Today we got Maximus the Mad and his, uh, the Mark of Khonshu is the scheme. So Maximus the Mad, once again, it's a bunch of new content today. I'm really excited. He has highest abominations, so he gets plus attack equal to the attack of the character with the highest HQ, uh, equal to the, to the highest attack value. Okay, I mean, that makes sense. Uh, he is Master Strike is reveal one of Maximus's remaining Mastermind tactics at random. Use its fight effect, then shuffle it back into those tactics. So that's interesting. And then over here, the Mark of Khonshu, 10 twists. Always include Khonshu Guardians and all 14 cards for an extra hero to the villain deck. As you can see, we got Medusa. She is our extra one here, and there's reasons for that once you see. I kind of was like, new material, but a little bit thematic, so that's fun. Um, it, the special rules are heroes on the villain deck are Khonshu Guardian villains with attack equal to their printed cost. While on the sewers, rooftops, or bridge, sewers, rooftops, or bridge, they get, uh, they have double their attack. When you defeat one, gain it as a hero. Twist is play two cards from the villain deck. When seven Khonshu Guardians escape, we lose. Includes both villain and henchmen. Awesome. All right, let's see what our opening, uh, heroes are. Destructive Whisper, Black Bolt, three cost, two attack. It's a blue card. You get plus one attack if you reveal four cards with no rules text. Speak no words. It's a two by one attack uh, black bolt. We got the super one of Archon the Magnificent, Lord of Dragons. Seven cost. It's yellow. He is factionless. Uh, zero plus by, zero plus attack. Patrol the rooftops. If it's empty, you get plus four attack and plus four fight. If it's not, defeat the villain there for free. Seems strong. Six cost Black Bolt, Silence is golden. Uh, commits for, a, he's a foot. Zero plus buy, four plus attack. Choose a card you played this turn with no rule text. You get its money and its attack again. And then we got uh, All Terrain Barbarian, Archon the Magnificent. Three cost buy, it's a green and a red card. Two plus Wall Crawl, which I believe you put on top of your deck after you buy it. I'm the best. Um, and then uh, patrol the sewers. If it's empty, you get plus one buy. Cool. All right. Honestly, these cards seem really strong. We have one, two. Oh, evil card. Always start with the evil card. It is a master strike. So with this, we will reveal one of the remaining master mic tactics at random and use its fight effect. So these can't be good is what we're learning. Fight. Put each ear from the HQ that doesn't have a printed cost, a printed attack of two or more on the bottom of the deck. Okay. So we lose these. <clears throat> these go here. That's been unfortunate. Uh, new Black Bolt. Gorgon 6. It's a... When recruited, you may KO one of your cards with no... Um, with no attack icon. And then highest abomination, so he gains attack equal to the highest. He's just like Maximus. We got another silence is golden. Uh, and then he gains the throne favor, which we're going to use to represent with the one ring. <clears throat> okay. Uh, and then we have to reveal another card. Another master strike. Are you kidding me? <laughs> What the heck is this? Put each hero without a cost of two or more on the bottom of the deck. We got Ultrain Barbarian. Stomping Shockwave. Five cost. It's a Gorgon. It's a green card. Two plus attack when recruited Sewers Abominations after refi refilling the HQ. Sewers Abomination. What does that mean? So Abomination... This character gets plus attack. Oh, we get attack equal to that. Okay. And then we got Spectrum Draw a Card. Uh, if he already has it, he spends it. And each player KOs one of their non-gray heroes. Well, luckily, we don't have any gray heroes. Am I going to get to play this game? <laughs> Am I going to uh, get to play? Scheme Twist. So, Scheme Twist has played two cards from the villain deck. We got a Master Strike. Are, am I going to be able to take my first turn? Is what we're going to... We're, we're wondering. We're kind of wondering here. So let's shuffle this up. 
Each player kills one of their gray or hero gains a wound. Okay, we're gonna gain a wound. Can I play this game? This is, I haven't been able to do anything. I mean, the plus side, we're getting through these master strikes. So this is still card number one of those two off the scheme twist. All right, this is a bystander that's gonna go under Maximus. Card number two is a Medusa. Okay, it's finally my turn. We have two, three, five. So I really wanted to buy one of those, um, <clears throat> one of those, uh, I really wanted to buy one of those, um, Black Bolt ones that, you know, did something. All right, there's one, but I, I, I'm, I want those. They seem like they're fine cards. One, two, three, four, five, six. Evil card is another Medusa. So when they're in the sewers, rooftop, or bridge, they double their attack. Okay. Um, patrol the sewers. If it's empty, we get plus one buy. So we're just at two, three, four. We're going to buy this black bolt. We have three attack, which unfortunately doesn't do anything. One. I spent all this time reading those nice cards, and then I just got to not do anything with any of them. But, you know, Maximus, he's mad. And, I mean, we only have two Master Strikes left in this giant deck, so that's kind of nice. Evil card. Medusa. All right, so this Medusa is only two now. So we can probably get there. Uh, two by, four by, and one attack. Two attack, so we can defeat this Medusa, gaining it. When recruited, gain the throne's favor. I don't know if we recruit this. It just says gain that hero, so I'm going to assume uh, we don't gain it because it's not we don't recruit that hero. But we do have six currency, so we're going to use to buy that um, black bolt. I don't know why, but I love the Black Bolt cards in this game. They always intrigue me. I think their design is really cool. Uh, it's a three cost Gorgon red, two buy. When recruited, you may teleport a zero cost hero from your hand. And then as you've played a red card, you may teleport another card from your hand. Evil card for this turn is a Khonshu Guardian. So this guy has five attack this turn. But we have one, two, three, four, five by power. <clears throat> What's our card colors looking like? Okay. We could probably get away with buying this as Spectrum to draw a card, hopefully, in the future. We're going to buy a sidekick as well for our last two money. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Evil card for the turn is a scheme twist. So that means we're going to play two cards. First card is Omega. His is Abomination, Fight. Choose Alpha or Omega, then reveal the top card of your deck. If it costs zero, KO it. If it costs one or more, draw it. Into another Medusa. Okay, so we got to really try to kill some people this turn. <clears throat> Unfortunately, our hand sucks for it. I mean, we actually can get this Medusa, so we can kill you that which is nice. We then have three currency. I'm going to buy one of these black bolts that care about textless cards. Head lead the inhuman elite. It's an eight cost Gorgon. It's green. Four plus attack when recruiting bridge abomination after refilling the HQ. Um, and then teleport rooftops abominations if I have E. This abominations keyword is very confusing to me. Scheme twist ain't great. First card is going to be a Medusa. And then the next one is, so we have one Medusa escape. We put a card on the bottom. Warlord of Open Spaces, Archon the Magnificent. It's a three, uh, five cost yellow, three plus attack. Patrol two adjacent city spaces. If they're both empty, you get plus one attack. And uh, nice. And then this lineage shows up. All right, so we have one of the seven that can escape for the uh, scheme. This does look like there's some stuff we can do here. 
We can do this spectrum to draw a card with just this guy, so that's three colors. Okay. I'm kind of digging this. So she's three, this guy's four, this guy's five. Two buy and one attack, so we're at three attack. We're at four attack. So we can defeat you. And we just want to not see a scheme twist next turn. So we get a KO card from our hand or discard pile. We're going to get rid of one of these shield agents, I think. And then Zabu can get out of here. So we have four, six. I'll grab this three plus attack one. Seems pretty okay. If we ever stabilized, it can be four. Lash! Abomination Ambush. Choose a hero from the HQ that doesn't have a printed cost of two or more. Put on the bottom of the hero deck. It must be you! Trample Underhoof. Gorgon. Six cost. Green. When recruited, you may kill one of your cards with no attack icon. Plus one highest abomination. Oh, we know that one. <clears throat> All right, we're going to gain the throne's favor. The Ring of Destiny... So we have one attack, two attack. So six, seven attack in total. Okay. So she's four. This guy's four as well. All right, well, we're going to fight. Uh, we're going to buy this Destructive Whisper, I think. <clears throat> okay. Oh, my shirt's all inside out. <laughs> I just am feeling the tag right here. That's funny. So we have four, five, six, seven. So tricky. I think we got to focus on these Khonshu Guardians, though. So this one's four. And then we're left with three, which unfortunately doesn't do anything. But that's just the reality of the situation. Oh, I shuffled that into my deck. And you know what? I'm going to actually... Uh, that was... A, oh, no, no, that is. That is that is how we're supposed to do that. That was a Medusa. All right, we just want to dodge a uh, Scheme Twist here. And there are ten in that deck. Or nine in that deck. Sorry, seven in that deck. So odds are we're going to hit one here. But, like, it would be nice if we didn't. Evil card. Okay, that's really good. <clears throat> okay, this is just yet another turn that we can try to crawl out of this hole. Unfortunately, our hand's not great. We're going to draw a card because we have this spectrum right here. Okay, this is better. Four. Five. So we can KO this guy which will allow us to KO one of our heroes. It's gonna be you. Uh, the sewers are empty, so we're gonna get plus one buy, so we're at three, four, five. I'm gonna grab the draw card, and then grab a sidekick too. Lockjaw is a very fitting sidekick to get here. There's Lockjaw, good boy. Evil card is Scheme Twist. So this Scheme Twist is actually probably okay. Because we're only going to lose one. We do have a Super Medusa, which is kind of spooky. 
We've had two escape, put a card on the bottom. Okay. Two attack, two buy, four cards with no rules text, so that's an additional three. So we have eight attack this turn. Okay. She's 14. We do want to attack her and defeat her. That would be nice. So we have eight attack. So this guy's seven. This guy's four and this guy's five. <clears throat> Two, we're gonna buy a sidekick. Okay. We want to defeat him. He's seven, but we do get to rescue four bystanders. So we have one attack left, essentially. So this could be good. This could cascade into something. When you rest this bystander, it becomes a villain. This was not good. <laughs> um, regular. When you rest this bystander, put any number of heroes. Ooh, that could be nice. Sorry, Gorgon, your playstyle just isn't really mine. You know what, I'm even going to get rid of the super because it powers down Maximus a lot. Um, okay, patrol the sewers. It's not empty. Okay, you know, I'm for it. The bystander turning into a bad guy was not great. This guy escapes. He has no escape trigger. Uh, put a card on the bottom. Honestly, it's going to be you. Teleport a zero cost hero. Okay. This hand's sick. This hand is going to be s uh, nice. So she's 14 here. We want to get her when she's there. This one's three and fight KO one of your heroes. So ultimately that is good. All right, we got Black Bolt. We're going to double this guy. <laughs> Not triple. So we'll go like that. So now we're looking at a lot of attack. We're going to spend the throne's favor to get an additional two attack. And then we're going to gain the throne's favor again. Give me the magic ring. So now let me just look at this. We have one, four, eight, nine, ten. <clears throat> This guy's five. This guy's also five. This guy's three. Um, with our four currency, we're probably going to buy that. So we have ten. We can get to thirteen in total. We're going to start by fighting this guy for six, I think. We're going to fight him for six, which leaves us with four. Uh, we're going to say alpha. Cool. We don't KO a card. Um, then with our remaining... With our remaining th four... We can play him to get to seven. We're going to defeat Lineage and then rescue two bystanders. When you rescue this bystander, a play of your choice gains a shield officer. Well, it's going to be me. And then this person shows up again. That's unfortunate. So then we spent a total of... <clears throat> sorry. Six. We had one, two, three, four. Eight, nine, ten. Thirteen in total. <clears throat> Thirteen in total. And then we spent six plus five. So 11. We have two left we can't do anything with. We're going to buy this guy. All right, these uh, shapeshifter uh, bystanders can freaking get out of here, man. Especially getting two, one right after the other. That's kind of unfortunate. Oh, sorry, I put a bystander in my deck. I just saw it while shuffling. And this Constru Guardian, get out of there. You guys should be in my victory pile. <clears throat> Four. 
six. Evil card is, Scheme Twist is what we were scared of. Scheme Twist, so we have to draw three more cards. Lash. Honshu Guardian, a guy's going to escape, so we're going to put a card on the bottom. We have to draw one more card. Super Black Bolt, for each card with no rules text you draw, you play this turn, draw a card. That card's incredible. Last card is another Medusa. So we've now had three escape. <clears throat> we are running out of deck for sure. Put a card on the bottom, because another one escapes. Sorry, Gorgon, once again, you're just not my play style. Okay. We want to get to three attack. Luck we can get there. We're going to phase this Lockjaw aside, I think. We have three currency. We're going to grab this one. I can bump this up to three. To spending the throne favor to defeat you. KOing you. <clears throat> Evil card is the unspoken. Choose a hero from the HQ that doesn't have a printed cost of two or more. We gain a wound because there's no one that can do that. <clears throat> okay, this hand's kind of sick. Two, four. We're going to double that. It's an additional one and an additional two. We're going to gain the throne's favor over here. We can only reveal three cards with no rules text, but this is a lot of attack, and this is kind of what we need. So we have one, two, three, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. <clears throat> So we can spend three on you and KO this guy. We have eight remaining. We can spend five on here, KO one of your heroes. No, we don't want to do that yet. We could spend seven on you. I'm just spend seven on you. We do have to also work on Maximus, but the thing is, like, that's kind of how this one works. Oh, you should have been in my hand. That's okay. I'll just phase you again. Evil card is a Medusa. Okay, we're going to start here and draw two cards. Great draws. Get out of here, Maria Hill. You suck. <laughs> you suck. Okay. We're going to start there, three attack. Ooh, we don't get a draw card off that. We don't have enough. Actually, no, here's the thing you do. You play this one first, and then we're going to spend the throne's favor to draw a card. And then you're going to be like, it was easy. We had Spectrum the whole time. We had Spectrum the whole time. Okay, that's looking nice. The sewers ain't empty and they're mighty expensive. So we're gonna use him here this turn. So we got three, so we got six, nine, 10, 12 this turn. <clears throat> Maximus is 11. Are we worried about a scheme twist? Maybe? <clears throat> Five, nine, ten, twelve. Two, three, five. Okay. Sorry, just thinking. All right, we're gonna play our money too. We got two, four, six. I'm gonna buy you for three. 
and then a sidekick for two. We're going to spend five of our 12 on this guy, and we're going to KO one of these guys. We have seven remaining. We can defeat him. Now the big boys are kind of finished, so we can just like, Lockjaw, get out of here. We can kind of just hope for the best. And we have KO'd a good number of cards from our deck. We can't like just pretend that, you know, that's not good. Six. Evil card is Scheme Twist. Do a Medusa. Do a Scheme Twist. Draw two more cards. Draw three more cards. Medusa. Master Strike. So we have to draw two more cards now. Do you ever feel like the game's playing you? Because that's how I feel with this one. He gains this. Okay, two more cards still. Medusa into Medusa. We have four escape. I don't think we're gonna win, considering we only have five cards left. And a good chunk of those are gonna be scheme twists. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, only one of them is. But still. Still, we just weren't able to ever get ahead of it, right? <clears throat> okay. We're going to gain the throne's favor, stealing it from Maximus. That's kind of sweet. Three attack. Two buy, four buy. We can double up this one for one more buy. So we're at three, four, five. And we have seven attack. So we can defeat these two and gain them. Uh, two, so we have five. Kind of uh, falling apart here. We need to get 11 attack, so we need to get 44 attack in like a limited number of turns. The unspoken. Nice. That time it didn't actually do anything. Man, these extra wounds really did something here. Okay, we're in a spectrum, but no spectrum. So we start here, then we spend this to draw a card, and then we can get spectrum. Okay, because we have a red. So we'll draw a card, and then we'll draw a card here. Six attack, six buy, so we're gonna buy that card. And then we have five, seven, <clears throat> nine, 10, 11. So we're gonna defeat Maximus. Just like how we fought Macho Gomez. We just gotta get one win, right? We gotta get one W. Uh, we discard down to four cards, but we only have one. And then each player discards down to three cards if he has the throne favor, otherwise he gains it, so. Nothing too spooky. It's Medusa. Awful hand. This could fix it. Look at the top three cards of your deck. Draw one, put the rest back in any order. I'll tell you this did not fix it. <laughs> I'll tell you that did not fix it. We're gonna gain the throne's favor. We're gonna spend the throne's favor to get two money. Don't draw a card. Attack here. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight attack. We can defeat these two. And allow me to KO a card. Hmm. Yeah, this one's kind of been going. It's not been like a, a crazy, crazy, crazy fun time. 
It's just a. I think it's because my deck's awkward. We've lacked. I mean, also having to fight Medusas to gain them. Like she's fine, but she's no. Uh, she could be a lot better. Scheme twist. Two cards. One's a master strike, so that'll be. That won't be a win. That will not be a win. That one's over, but I am excited to try the two Black Bolts together. I think that's going to be really fun in the future. Um, this one, as I said, we do walk away with an L. And I think it's actually technically, if I remember correctly, it's like a draw at this point. But to me, if you don't win, that's an L right there. So we'll see you guys next week for some more, or some eventually, because uh, you know it's kind of like it's more like a free flowing update schedule for uh, Marvel Legendary. But we'll see you guys in the near future for another episode. Uh, I'm going to record one more today, so there's for sure going to be another episode coming out. Uh, see you guys very soon. Have a good one, and as always, GGs.